Hello everyone, this is Khurram from iGetsWell and in today's video I want to do some comparison. I want to show you guys my LG OLED TV which is the uh, gallery design so it's placed to the wall and then I have the Apple Vision Pro right here connected to the PlayStation 5 and it's streaming directly and you can see how big of the screen it makes on the display for you. This is 65 inch and you can see this one is almost like 85 inch but you can actually increase the size of the screen. Uh, sorry about the noise of the birds in the back. They always start talking when I'm talking. Um, but as you guys can see that this is the TV LG OLED, which is using the OLED panel, of course. And this one is using the micro OLED on the Apple Vision Pro. So the blacks are going to be pretty solid on the uh, Apple Vision Pro because it is using the OLED technology, which has the infinite contrast. So you're going to have the darkest dark and the brightest bright the way it should be and I like the color accuracy on the Apple Vision Pro so let's just go into the game and also there is barely any lag when you're streaming from the PlayStation 5 I'm right now streaming and you can see that um, there is that screen so I'm gonna make it a little smaller so you guys can see the response time I was pretty impressed with the response time on this I think I'll just make it go over there so let's say that's the PlayStation 5 connected to the TV with HDMI directly and there's LAN cable connected so make sure it's connected with the Ethernet because that's when you're going to get the good quality and this right here is streaming from PlayStation 5. So now let's see when I'm moving around you can see on the TV which is connected directly via HDMI and then it is streaming on the Apple Vision Pro. I'll suggest please don't use the uh, Wi-Fi when you're uh, connecting it with the um, you know the wireless connectivity is not reliable but when you're talking about the um, connecting it with the wired connection for the PlayStation 5 at least I mean you cannot connect the Apple Vision Pro uh, with the wire or Ethernet but still you want to make sure that at least one of your devices is connected with the uh, Ethernet and this is pretty impressive I mean I'm not gonna be playing this game you know how to play better than me but see the input lag on this there's barely any i mean both the screens are showing almost the same timing right here i'm gonna point there and press these buttons Entry. there you go so the app that i'm using to stream from the playstation 5 to the uh, screen here on the apple vision pro is called mirror play and I'm using the local streaming. There is one which is remote streaming. So remote streaming is going to be uh, more input lag because it's going to be streaming via internet. But when you're using the local streaming, it's going to be using the internet connectivity that you have in the house. Not internet connectivity, but the network connectivity. You know, the uh, intranet, not internet. So I see the great quality here with the Apple Vision Pro. And the best thing is that can just look at the screen go on the corner and just pinch it to make it this huge experience so I'm really loving the way um, the screen looks you can watch um, you know the movies TV shows and now you can play PlayStation 5 games without any delay so I'm interested in doing more testing and make a tutorial about how you can set up the mirror play with the playstation 5 so if you guys are interested in that make sure to hit the like on this video and subscribe to the channel and leave me a comment what you want to see from the next videos and that's all i have from this one guys hope you enjoy it and see you another one until then peace out